It is Monday, December 5th, 2016, and Vlogmas has started, well, it started last week, <laughs> but I am starting this week. So normally what people do is they upload every single day, um, vlogs every single day of what they've done during the day. Me, I don't have anything too exciting going on since I work more than half of the time, so I don't want to bore you guys or anything. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do like Vlogmas week one, Vlogmas week two, blah, 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 until we get to Christmas. That way, hopefully I have more than enough footage for you guys to enjoy. So I'm excited to do this for you guys. Um, I've been so into vlogs lately, especially around Vlogmas time. I was up till like three in the morning watching Vlogmas vlogs. It's just so much fun. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, it's Monday, and Monday is my day off, so, um, it's around 9 o'clock or something right now, and I just got out of the shower, so I'm doing some laundry, and I am doing a cleanse this week. I'm ready to get back on it. So I was gonna go to the gym this morning, but I think my husband and I will go later today because I'm off, so I can really go whenever I want. I like going to the gym when I can with him because he's a huge motivator. Him being there makes me work out like 10 times harder just because I know he's doing it too. So um, I'm going to wait for him to get home and then see how he feels and then um, head to the gym. But y'all, yeah, we rarely get to work out together so the times that I'm able to work out with him I really enjoy. So I'm going to start off the morning. I just put a load of laundry in, excitement. Now I'm going to make my little smoothie this morning and we'll see what else we're I think I'm going to film something today too, so we'll see. So first off, I'm not a professional in what I'm doing. I just want smoothies all week to cleanse, just do a liquid cleanse and also sometimes just use the protein powder. But this is what I use. Um, when I was working out before, this is what I would do on a daily. Whenever I got home from the gym, I would just drink one of these. And they're super yummy, so... But yeah, I'm not a professional. This is just what I do. And I know my body best, so... Let me show you what I do here. And nothing against what anybody does, but me, for my body, it doesn't work to do, like, this all the time, to do those re meal replacement shakes every single day of my life. Because I know once I eat something, I'm gonna gain it all back. That quick. So this is just a cleanse to get me started. Drink my stomach just a little bit so I can um, help with my portion control because I know I've been through this so many times. I know if I don't kind of slowly get myself back to, into it, then I'm gonna fall off really quickly. So this is a way that kind of gets me into it. So this is what works best for me, like I said. So let me show you how I make my little smoothie here. So whenever I do anything, I'm just too lazy. I don't do measurements, nothing. I just kind of put in how I feel, how much should go in there. So I'm going to put in some of these fruits here. So this is like peaches, grapes, strawberries, pineapples. Normally I just do like a berry medley. So I do like blueberries and raspberries, whatever. So I put a little bit in there. And then we're going to put some protein powder. I got to come back. Hold on. So since I'm doing a cleanse, I'm going to put a whole scoop in there because normally when I get back from a workout, I don't put a whole scoop because I'm eating regular food, obviously. Um, so, but I do need my protein since I'm doing this cleanse all week. So we're just going to do the whole cup here. I'm too lazy to get it exactly correct. So let's pour that in there. And then we're going to do some almond milk. Sometimes I don't use almond milk. I'll just use like ice or water but we have this big old one in the fridge from thanksgiving so i'm gonna go ahead and just use this one instead of water today so basically what i do with this is i'll just pour that guy in there just a little bit and then i'm gonna add a little bit more fruit just to kind of top it off here oh i'm so bad at recording with one hand excuse me Okay, so I think we're good. So now we're going to throw that on the blender here. Why is it? Oh, and I'm going to add just a little bit of water in here too because I know for sure that the blender is not going to go with not that much liquid. 
So I'm going to top it off with some water. No, I think we're good. Man, you guys, it's snowing like crazy outside, but it's not going to stick because it's not cold enough. And the ground is wet, so. Sucks! Pointless! That's super good. And sorry in advance, well, this isn't really advanced, but <laughs> sorry I look so hash right now, but it's because this is raw footage, so you ask for it, you get it. <laughs> so as you guys can see, no more like flashes or weird things going on with my screen because I got a new phone. I got the iPhone 7 Plus and I got the second highest in storage, like the gigabytes or whatever, I don't know the terms for it. But so we'll see how much footage it lets me put on this phone before I have to put it on my computer before I'd only be able to do like two clips and I would be totally out of storage. It's actually starting to stick. Ooh, sticking to the road too. I didn't think it was going to stick. So we shall see you guys. I finally fixed up my vanity here a little bit. As you can see, the brushes are over there. We got the lippies, a few stuff here. And I still have to go through these, but at least I fixed it up a little bit here. But I was going to show you guys this. This I got last year for my mom and I. <clears throat> so what this is, is it's the Secret Daily Teachings. I don't know if you guys have ever read the Secret book, but it's really good and it's motivating and inspiring. And uh, these little quotes just, you know, make my day and to read them in the morning. So every day you turn the page, rip out a page um, for the day it is. So I already had Sunday, obviously. Today is Monday. I think my mom's already finished hers. Like, I've stopped mine. I don't know how many times. Um, so Monday's note is... We can never bring anything to us unless we are grateful for what we have. In fact, if somebody was completely and utterly grateful for everything, they would never have to ask for anything. Because it would be given to them before they even asked. That is the power of gratitude. This is day 64. These things are good to read in the morning, you know, because you start off the morning with a positive thought. It gets you very motivated for your day. I think I got mine on Amazon. On Amazon. It was super cheap for me and my mom. Um, just to kind of say, start our day off positive. So, yep, there is that for you guys. Since I'm most likely filming something today, I was going to curl my hair, but I think I'm just going to straighten it because... My curling iron's in the car and I'm too lazy to go get it. <laughs> so I'm going to straighten my hair real quick and put in some extensions, actually. I can't wait till my hair grows out again. Cannot wait. You know, everybody gets that time where once you've cut it short where they're, they're missing their long hair. And I'm sure once I have long hair again, I'm going to miss short hair. So you're just, you're just never satisfied. Never. <laughs> so I'm going to straighten my hair and probably get to filming. So I just did a really quick, like, rose gold kind of holiday look. I'm super hungry, so I think I'm going to make another smoothie. My stomach is kind of hurting. I know it's going to be hard the first couple of days um, to go ahead and do this cleanse, but I know I need it. I know my body needs it, so just got to drink lots of water and make sure to do my three smoothies a day. So yeah, I just got done filming. I'm going to go ahead and upload this and hopefully get it edited. So my hair seems super long and voluminous, voluminous today, but it's just because I put my extensions in for the video. So I'm going to go make me another smoothie before I get super, super hangry, and I'll be right back. I'm starting to get a little bit hangry, so I'm going to make me another smoothie so I don't, like, attack someone or hit someone with my car. So yeah, I just got done filming. I just did this quick little look. I don't even know what kind of look it was. I don't know, some kind of holiday look. <laughs> Why is there like 5,000 crows? Like, is something dead over here? Because look at all these freaking flocks of birds. What are these crows? Where are they everywhere? What is happening? Where'd they go? They're all like sitting right there. That's so weird. So weird. Yeah, I was just having all kinds of issues with this video. <laughs> like, my eyeliner, I kept smudging it. It was not going well. Nothing was working well. My filming situation, you guys know that we moved, so... Like, I was trying to film in my room, and it was too small of an area, so it was just all over the place. All over the place. My hair is so long right now. I love it. So, yeah, it wasn't the greatest video, but we'll see. I was over there talking to you guys, not even knowing I got a big ol' makeup face on my shirt from putting it on. 
it's like I didn't want to ruin my eyebrows and I didn't want to take off my face so therefore it went on the shirt we are heading to go work out now and this is the pre-workout that my husband takes and sometimes I take it's the Hyde I don't know who this is by Mr. Hyde and I just take half a scoop because I'm a lightweight and if I take more than that then I'll get super shaky but yeah just took our pre-workout and we are heading to Lisa's room got done with the workout I never wear makeup when I'm working out but I didn't have time to take it off but yeah that was a really good workout my husband pushed me pushed my butt got some cardio in and some arm workouts but yeah we're done with that one I'm gonna go home and make a smoothie and then tomorrow back at it again so I'm probably gonna be going to the gym like around five or something in the morning tomorrow so I'll take you guys with me again. See you later. Good morning, you guys. It is Tuesday, December 6th now. I'm on my way to the gym. It is now, what, 5.40 something in the morning. And I feel like I was just at the gym. <laughs> so, but my body feels good. I'm super sore and, you know, I'm just, I'm super motivated. So, I woke up at like four or something with my husband this morning. He headed to work. But I am going to the gym because I'm ready to get this workout in. So, <clears throat> get this done, get the day started right, and then the rest of the day will go good as well. So, we'll see you guys when I get there. You guys don't even know like how excited I am to get back into my routine. It's been so long since I've been able to, you know, have a regular routine. So, now that I'm back at it, I'm super super stoked because you know just like I say so I've told you guys so many times you know just working out puts you in a good mood especially when you start out in the morning you know it gets your body right in the morning your head right in the morning I can't work out after work because I'll make I'll come up with every single excuse in the books until um, I end up not going so this is the only way you know before my brain can think right I'm just like just get your butt in the car let's go <laughs> but I'm just overly excited to be getting back into my routine and to just, you know, lifestyle changes. This is how i always been. I've always been an athlete since I was young, so I'm used to just working out every single day and just feeling lazy and all that is not my thing. Feeling lazy and fat and ugh, just gross is not my thing and I'm so over with doing, with being like that. So, I mean, I can eat good, let me tell you that. I'm a huge foodie and that'll never go away. But as long as I'm working out, I know I'll feel better about the choices I make when I'm eating. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. Just a little motivation as I go to the gym. So like I said, I'll see y'all there. Okay, I just got to work. I'm so tired you guys I woke up at 4 this morning and um, I was just so eager to go to the gym I wanted to get my workout in and now I'm paying for it because I'm so tired it's about 9 o'clock and I'm just starting work now so hopefully it goes by fast I'm ready to take a nap I think also this cleanse is getting to me because you know I'm just drinking liquids so I'm not really eating everything I'm supposed to be eating so yeah We'll see how today goes, but I'm hoping with water and everything I'll get a little more energized. But yeah, I'm about to head into work, and I will see you guys probably after. Decided to go all black today. Black boots, black dress, and leggings. Luckily I have boots to cover these suckers. I needed some long socks though. <laughs> but yeah, you never know what's hiding under them boots. You guys, check this house out. They went all out. Isn't that so pretty? This is right across the street from my house. That's crazy, huh? And what makes me laugh the most is look at this next house. <laughs> so it says ditto and there's a little point, there's a little arrow that's pointing over there. But that's crazy. I wonder how much their light bill is. My goodness. 
Hey you guys, it is Wednesday, December 6th now, or sorry, December 7th. <laughs> and oh my gosh, it's just so, it's freezing outside right now. It's supposed to snow and get super icy tomorrow. Um, as you guys saw earlier in my vlog, it did snow earlier this week, but it is way colder right now. Woo! My, my little nails is frozen. Um, so yeah, I just got home and I was going to tell you guys earlier this morning, but I was kind of rushing to work, but I'm done with the cleanse. It didn't work right with my body. Some people can do it. Some people can handle it. Me, I just couldn't. I got a really bad migraine, sick to my stomach. Normally that goes away after, you know, a couple hours, but it wasn't going away. <laughs> so I had to eat something solid. I'm still eating healthy and everything, but I'm just not doing the cleanse anymore. Um, working out and all that still but the cleanse is over at least I did it for a day and a half that's okay that's better than nothing but I wanted to update you guys on that part of things but yeah I'm at home for a quick lunch I might make like some eggs or something um, I need to go shopping for some veggies and fruits and some stuff like that um, but I'm just gonna eat something really quick right now so we'll see you guys in a little bit Honestly, it wouldn't be like that that cold, but it's so windy that the wind is like freezing. I don't know what the temperature is. Um, this morning when we woke up, it was super, super icy. Um, and my husband had to leave early to work, so I was kind of nervous for him. But it was super icy, and I know even last night, like I didn't even want to go outside. It was so cold, so I know it's not like negative degrees, but out here it's pretty cold for us. Plus, when, we, when you get those freezing winds, that makes it seem even colder, so... Um, but it's super windy. I'll have to show you guys when I head back to work. So I'm out here in Washington and when it snows, people go psycho. People go crazy. Like they've never seen snow before. Um, it is pretty cold though. It's like mother nature slapped me in the face every time I walk outside with that wind. That wind is so cold. But, um, yeah, so we'll see about tomorrow. I'm like, if I have to, I'll walk to work. I'm super close, but I'm going to go back into work. Speaking of work right now. So we'll go, we'll see you guys a little bit later. Yes, I know I look like hell right now, <laughs> but I'm just editing. Um, we don't have work today because the snow is a coming and, you know, it gets pretty crazy in Washington when, I don't know if I'm getting sick, excuse me, I sound like a man, sound like a man. Oh my gosh, that was so yuck. <laughs> so they're basically closing down today because it's supposed to be snow and then ice and that's not safe. So... Um, I'm just editing and I'm going to start editing my vlog so I can put it up for you guys. I want to have some more footage from this weekend if we do anything this weekend. So I'll most likely have it up like Sunday or Monday. And then Monday I'm going to film some more too and vlog some more next week as well. But I thought I'd update you guys a little bit on what's going on today. So just editing, watching This Is Us and going to start editing the vlog. Other than that, I'm just chilling chilling nice and warm nice and comfy uh, my husband went to work in Portland so I really 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 am praying that he gets home safely because people just get crazy out here like they get wacko like they don't know how to drive they just go crazy trying to get home so I really hope he doesn't get stuck he's a Missouri boy so he knows how to drive in this type of weather but not other people I do not trust other people so <laughs> so yeah praying that my family gets home safe because everybody is at work but me um, as far as the Vancouver family here. So yeah, I'm just gonna continue editing and everything and we'll see you guys in a little, little bit. It hasn't started snowing yet, but oh my gosh, the tarps are off. I don't know if that flew off or if my dad took it off. Um, because those things, oh, there's a little puppy in the backyard, you see <laughs> Um, but it's been so windy since yesterday. I was telling you guys at lunchtime, it's so cold and windy, oh my gosh. Um, but it's supposed to start snowing around 10 right now. It's around almost, it's eight something. Um, so, whoo, I think it's going to hit here pretty soon. And there's a lady looking out the window, so that's really awkward. It's been a couple hours now and I still look like I got hit by a plane. <laughs> so I'm still over here editing. I was going to have, see if TJ wanted to do the voiceover, but I'll just get the video up. It's something really short, so we'll just see if he'll do it later. Um, so I just wanted to get the video up. It's a little holiday soft glam look for you guys, so that'll be up probably within the next few hours. Obviously, you guys are going to see this video way later than you see this one, so I don't know. I'm telling you that. It has started snor snoring. <laughs> Dude, I'm on crack or something. My goodness. So it's been snowing for about an hour now. 
I'm gonna laugh so hard if it gets really bad. Um, but this is this is this is all the winter storm of 2016 is here, you guys. Look at I feel bad for the ants and the spiders. <laughs> um, but yeah. It still is snowing, but it's like little flurries. Um, it might start coming here soon. <coughs> My twin sister's in the Dalles, and it's really, really snowy over there. So um, we'll see. It might be coming. So I'm going to laugh at myself later if I look at this footage. And yeah, there's bigger snowflakes coming now. So yeah, just kidding. <laughs> it's like so crazy windy right now. You see how fast the snow is going by. Look at those things flying everywhere. And that wind is freaking brisk as a mofo. Super cold. But yeah, I wouldn't leave your stuff in the backyard at this time. Focus. Focus. Look how big the snowflakes are now. Whoo, it's coming. My husband's heading home from downtown Portland because he said it's getting really bad out there. So, but yeah, I think it's about to hit us too. Eek. Try to get home. Yeah, that's that's what's scary is the ice. Yeah. It's not to the snow. No, and the more you go over all this white stuff, it turns into ice. Mm-hmm. Because it melts it. No, he's saying country temporarily. He started singing country when he first started. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right? Wow. My waffle. <laughs> she was like, it gets into the crevices and everything.
with the familiar. We're rewatching Magnificent Seven. Finally got a top to bottom in Vancouver. My husband's the one that wired it. I know what. Bikinis. Thirteen dollars. That's cute. Ooh, they're so pretty. I like the purple. But what Mazda is doing is getting the people specifically and directly connected oh. with the community. I like the food, but just the friendship. guys sorry i haven't vlogged too much this weekend just been super busy getting stuff done for the week and everything um but just been hanging out with the parents today we're just running around um running some errands before the week starts as well my husband is going to get a cure rig right now so i'm super excited to have our cure rig for the winter time so after that we're gonna go um look at some tools and stuff for him and i'm also trying to find a little table to film on I've been needing one of those because I've been struggling lately with my filming situation. So hopefully we'll find something like that today. We went to go watch Moana last night, so I think I'm going to review it in a video. I'll probably film that tomorrow for you guys. Yeah, I was showing you guys last night. Um, we have a top to bottom in Vancouver now, and I'm super excited because I love top to bottom. We always had to come over to Portland side to go there. So um, yeah, I got a few things there. I did get this hat. It's like a distressed um, black hat. They had a whole bunch of different colors. They had olive and like an army print and a bunch of different, a bunch of different colors. A bunch of different colors too. So, um, and cute. I kind of recorded some of the um, beanies and stuff they had. They're really cute. But I'm excited to have them here now and they have all the LA colors makeup and everything there too. And the girl at the front was so, she was so sweet too. That was helping me. Um, but... Yeah, so I'm excited to have that in town now. Um, so other than that, just running around today. We're going to decorate the house a little bit later too as well. So I'll kind of vlog some of that too. But we'll talk to you guys a little bit later, probably when we're decorating the house. All nice and set up now. Woohoo! We got this thing with it too for free, so nice. I'm gonna test it out here now too. Flavors we got. We got dark roast for TJ and I and my parents, mostly drink decaf. Um, so we got them a little decaf one too. They're not home yet, so we're kind of just surprising them with this little setup here. I'm going to test it out real quick. I love the blue lights. They're so pretty. Come here. Okay. <laughs> I got yummies. Yum you sauce. did? Yum sauce. Look what's set up over here. What's set up? Oh, a curry. Oh, oh you guys <laughs> get it. Oh, my goodness. The yes. little thing came with it, too. We got you guys this little, oh. um, yeah. We got you guys oh. this little um, decaf one. Oh so. my goodness! Yep, we put half decaf and half. Oh, we're the... gonna have to shop for different other flavors. I know there's too. a whole bunch of other flavors, but we thought we tried these ones wow. first. Cool. So he wants to test the first cup. Go for it. That's you? Cool. No. <laughs> DJ. Hello. Yeah. These little bulbs that. Is it gonna be too heavy for the tree? Why? Because I can't. Get you just it. put two of those things together. Oh. So maybe Put these two these and then two. bring that one down. Yep. Okay. Or maybe three. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. And then just put it straight. Yeah, straight. There we go. Okay. And this will go back here and then yep. we'll plug it in with Pretty. the rest of it. Yay. That little thing that would come and bring things to my work where I got your gel pins and stuff. Uh huh. That's where I got that from. Oh, they're so cute. How is you guys? Is. Little, little I have those stockings. made for you guys. Oh, it's fine. Dry. Mm -hmm. 
see. Pretty. And mm -hmm. Shelby. Oh. Are these our old bolts? They're ones that were we had last year. Are we gonna do tree. blue or the red? I think we should do the the red ones on this. If you want tea, make tea. Yay. While we lit up the Christmas tree Light another Christmas tree Girl, you know what I mean Last Christmas I gave you my heart But the very next day You gave it away This year To save me from tears I'll give it to someone special Last Christmas Okay, so I'm gonna end this vlog here. This is week one of Vlogmas for you guys. I may have to break it into part one and part two because I think I might have a little too much footage and I don't think you guys want to watch like 30 40 minutes of stuff so I might have to break it into part one and part two but we'll see um so I'm gonna go ahead and put this up for you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it please give me that thumbs up if you guys like I feel like I have something in my teeth really Belle really are we are we serious give me a kiss this cat is for real thirsty thirsty she just wants some muffins I love it so anyways <laughs> this is really weird um it's like freezing in the garage. Say hi. Love you. So, um, what was I saying? She distracted me. So, oh, and I was going to tell you guys that the Christmas music you guys hear in this vlog is by Mo Music. Um, I'll go ahead and link his SoundCloud down below. That guy is so talented. He has so much good music. I don't know if you guys have heard his beats and music producer. And he does all sorts of beats and stuff like that. And he's just... He's super talented. You guys need to follow him if you guys have not yet. Um, also follow him on Instagram as well. I'll link his information down below. But he did like he did a Poly Christmas album. It has like Finn, Aloki, uh, Fina Love, much more people in there too. But it's really good. So check it out. But other than that, if you guys hear that music in here, I have had it approved by him that I can use it. Um, but if you guys are interested, feel free to click on his info down below. So anyways, I'm ending this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave me a comment down below so I know what's real. And uh, we'll see you guys in next week's vlog. Bye. <laughs> I love you, Bella Ann. I love you. You're so precious. I love you. Just don't scratch me in the face. Don't lick off my highlight, please. Thank you. <laughs>